This month, millions of teens will enter the workforce, many for the first time. But finding a summer job isn't as easy as it used to be. Two News reporter Brandon Richard is live in the newsroom to explain. Brandon? Well, Marla, teen unemployment is three times the net overall national average. These days, teens aren't just competing against other teens for jobs. They're also competing against adults. But some teens are finding jobs, including at local pools. Hi, sir. Welcome to Big Splash. Mayor, we can check your bags right over here, and I can scan in your cards. Amy Crone is one of millions of American teens entering the workforce this summer. You guys have an awesome time. Last summer, she was a lifeguard at Big Splash Water Park in Tulsa. This year, she's a greeter there. I'm saving to buy a computer for college next year. Uh, you have to get pretty specific computers to be an engineering student, and so that's where all this money is going to. And the fact that Amy has a summer job sets her apart from some of her peers, even her own friends. They have a harder time finding jobs. It's kind of difficult right now. How difficult is it? The unemployment rate among teens aged 16 to 19 is nearly 25 percent. Compare that to the overall national average of 8.2 percent, or 5.0 for Oklahoma, and it's easy to see why teens love seasonal jobs, like those offered at water parks and swimming pools, be they private or public. The city of Tulsa is opening five pools this summer and has already hired most of the 40 lifeguards it needs. But a few positions are still available. It's between 8 and 8.50 an hour, so it's above minimum wage. And a lifeguard can make uh, around $3,000 through the course of the summer. And so no matter what kind of work they find themselves doing, many teens are just happy to have a J-O-B this summer. Now, as mentioned there in the story, five city pools will be opening across Tulsa this summer. To see which ones, log on to our website, kjrh.com. Live in the newsroom, Brandon Richard, 2 News works for you.